Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another exciting chapter. Let's get right on to it. Today, we are at the Science Center to learn about volume. Volume is used to measure the amount of liquid in a container. Now, why don't you all take a look around and explore the exhibits? Look at these containers filled with water. The amount of water in the container is called the volume of water. Let's compare some flasks. Look at flask A and B. Both flasks are the same size. Flask A contains as much water as flask B. Now let's look at these beakers. Beakers C, D, and E are the same size. The volume of water in beaker C is more than the volume of water in beaker D. The volume of water in beaker D is more than the volume of water in beaker E. Look at these bowls. The volume of colored water in bowl H is less than the volume of colored water in bowl G. Bowl F has the most volume of colored water. Bowl H has the least volume of colored water. Next, let's use containers to compare volumes. We have two jugs. Jug A and Jug B. Jug A can fill three empty beakers, while Jug B can fill five empty beakers. Therefore, Jug A contains less liquid than Jug B. Jug B contains more liquid than Jug A. Let's try another example to compare volume in different containers. Sure thing. Here are three jugs of the same size. Jug B has the smallest volume of liquid. Jug A contains more liquid than Jug B. Jug C has the largest volume of liquid. From the smallest to the largest volume of liquid, Jug B, Jug A, Jug C. That was cool! Let's do a quiz before moving on to the next lesson. <laughs> 